July 2011, the Worldview 2 satellite captures an extraordinary image of a lake that mysteriously disappears. One moment there's a lake, and the next it's gone. What's going on? The image shows a lake called Loch Orima in County Antrim, Northern Ireland. It's like someone just took the plug out. It's extremely weird. The lake's water has to be going somewhere. Wilson analyzes aerial and ground reconnaissance images for more clues. I went and looked at all the information that we had available to us, the maps from the geology surveys that have been done, where I thought the, the water would be coming back out. Wilson conducts an experiment to try to follow the vanishing water. I know that this water is all coming from Loch Arima because this has been traced using a dye which was put in to Loch Arima and the dye was found to come out at this location. Above this point, it's a completely dry riverbed. There's no water in it at all. As you come round the corner of this bend, then suddenly you have the spring and the river starts flowing again. How the water gets to this point from Loch Arima is still unclear. The geology of another vanishing lake could offer a clue. Canada's Medicine Lake sits on an unusual limestone landscape called Karst. Medicine Lake in Alberta is a great example of a lake that each year drains through the karst landscape beneath of it. Essentially what happens are there are sinkholes which form where the limestone beneath the ground dissolves over time to form a big cave. Karst limestone could drain the water from Loch Arima. Limestone is a very porous rock. Maybe the water just seeps away through that. There is evidence of karst limestone here, but in this mysterious Celtic landscape, nothing is as it seems. In normal karst limestone, you would typically have large caverns under the ground, but here are actually lots of different small channels, and there's lots of resistance in those. So whenever the pressure builds in the system, then the lake fills up. But during dry periods, the lake has the chance to drain out, and that's when the lake then, then empties. Paul Wilson's investigation may have uncovered where Loch Arima's water goes, but the lake still holds secrets. One of the things that's confusing is that the amount of water that's coming out of the spring is twice the amount that's actually going into Loch Arima. Why this happens, for now, remains unexplained. There might be another vanishing lake that we maybe haven't even seen before. It's still a big mystery.